welcome back to my channel today i'm gonna share with you a dish that is um, very nice simple to make and most of, of the time any asian families will love it okay i've done this a few times and my son just love it is braised fish head okay we're gonna use a very simple ingredients okay first look at the ingredients i have fish head here actually i have a five kilo um snapper okay this is a snapper a red snapper but i'm gonna only use half of the head because it's too big there's only three of us in a family so this i have already chopped the fish head and onions onion is option uh, optional if you like it but i like it okay so i put onion okay and garlic okay this garlic here like i always use the big round one this big round garlic just peel it wash it and give it a smash with the back of your knife so that it will come out all the flavorings and fragrance um spring onion or green onions you chop it and the stock of the spring onion green onion the back of it okay slice it i mean cut it to big long one so that give it that flavor chili just a little bit i'm using um what we call this chili pad ginger okay ginger slice it dark soya sauce thick one and uh, soya sauce i use about four spoon uh, cornstarch powder yeah you will need it for seasoning and a uh, pepper some water and of course some um, sesame oil to taste to give that fragrance and uh, sao xing hua diao jiu and fish sauce okay that's all the ingredients today okay let's get to this now in a while we'll get to the cooking now okay to start out with what we need to do is we need to season the fish head a little bit so just one tablespoon of uh, cornstarch powder why do we put cornstarch powder so that uh, later when you fry the fish head you, you will get the crispiness okay we just need to stir it just season this make sure it's all well mixed okay then only you will get all very um, even crispy crisp of the fish head okay we get ready to fry the fish head add in some oil put the fire into medium low because i'm using the fire stove not the electric one but if you use the electric one i'll suggest you can put medium okay because you want to fry so you can add a little bit more oil for those of you who are using stainless steel wok or pans you do not need to heat up the pan first but because i'm using a non-stick i need to heat up so you actually if you use a stainless steel pan or wok you can actually uh, without heating up you pour in the oil when you put in whatever you want to cook only you start heating up so that it won't stick because i'm using a non-stick pan so it's okay all right looks like we are ready we well, i'm going to be very careful with this yeah when you put this uh, I, I'm, I'm i'm also very scared up till today <laughs> okay just fry it very huge it's actually a five kilo gram fish head but i only use half of it okay just let it fry for a while okay, turn it. Yeah, I think so we're gonna turn it back again yeah make sure turn it back again So remember when you turn one side after one two minutes you have to turn it back to the other side so total is four times that put, put it this, this way and two times of uh, checking okay, it's getting brown now
gonna fry it for a little one more, say about another one one minute or so. Prepare the braised sauce. Okay. Our onion, garlic, ginger are all ready, all softened. The, especially the onion is softened. Remember, I said don't let it be over brown, just softened will do. Then we're going to add in the seasoning now. Like soya sauce, dark soya sauce. Okay. Actually, the reason why we add in dark soya sauce is actually to give the color and of course the taste but uh, major purpose is the colors so they can have the black color, braised color that um, normally all braised dish looks like because the light soya sauce tend not to have that um, very darkened color. Okay. Can on the fire back to medium okay water gonna let it shimmer two minutes plus it start to boil now we can put in the earlier fried fish head in And we want the sauce to absorb into the fish so that it gives the fish a very nice uh, flavor later on when we eat. Like I mentioned, if you don't like fish head, you don't like snapper, it's okay. You can use any fish or any part of the fish also. Okay? There's no uh, fast rule that you must use fish head. to medium low because I want to give it a good shimmering so that it can shimmer for a good three minutes to let the fish absorb so we'll come back later well this is how the fish head braised fish head looks like after I dish it up and I hope you like it <music> 